for exchange international. Okay, we're back here again with uh, DJ and Randolph. And Randolph's about to demonstrate a new uh, organ that just got put on our floor, for number 492. It's from 1966. And you're hearing it first here on Keyboard Exchange International because Randolph just sat down at a few minutes ago to play for the first time. But what we'd like to do before Randolph starts playing is give you one more story from the road. And I asked the guys, and they started laughing as soon as I asked them this question. What was the most, one of the most difficult situations you ever had in terms of picking up or dropping off in Oregon? And I thought they were going to talk about stairs. You know, like cause sometimes you have to get them out of a basement or something. But DJ's first impression was, no, 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 no. Well, DJ, why don't you tell the story? Look in the camera and speak yes, up for us, please. Yes, yeah, so it was uh, Dayton, Ohio, and uh, actually it was stairs. <laughs> <laughs> um, there was a basement, and um, so that was one aspect of it. It was a pickup. We had to get uh, the ramp that we used off the van also paired with a piece a couple pieces of plywood and you got to think you're going upstairs <laughs> gravity is against you yes so <laughs> gravity's yeah, nasty nasty, right. nasty, yeah. nasty you know? gravity and uh so we uh, finally got past that part so here's another hiccup the it, it not long before that it was raining so yes. it was really nice grass we didn't want to tear it up so the customer himself uh, agreed so we actually had to play uh, a game of leapfrog to get <laughs> the organ back to the van. <laughs> so put down the uh, ramp, ramp, plywood, plywood, push a little, leap the ramp back over, yes. <laughs> yes. all to save the man's grass. Yes, yes. <laughs> well, that was a reasonable request the man made. Of course, of course. Especially since you guys are now kind of well known for getting stuck in people's grass. <laughs> Oh, touche. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Well, that's not going to happen too often or maybe never again, really. Uh, yes. But the whole leapfrogging concept yes. was the proper way to go about it. Right. You know, because repairing grass, that's not something that anyone wants to do. Right. So right. you guys were, as always, very professional and you did yes, what sir. you had to do. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. But um, that's, an, that's story number two, episode number two of Stories from the Road. Mm -hmm. But DJ, why don't you and I step out of the camera for a moment, let Randolph uh, demonstrate number 492. It's got some imperfections in the wood, but we should give people a special price. Okay, let's yeah. do that. The other thing we were thinking is using this organ as a rental. Just keep it as a rental forever. But if somebody wants to fall in love with it, they don't mind a few I'm pretty sure they will. <laughs> well, let's find out. Give it a good uh, workout, and uh, thanks for your time and attention, folks. We'll uh, see you again. Yes, sir. Let's talk about another story from the road. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you. 
Thanks for watching our video and thank you also for uh, helping keep the Hammond Tone Wheel B3 organ alive. We couldn't do all this work that we do here without you. And it would also help greatly if you could subscribe, like, uh, ask for notifications for when we have new videos. That would be a big help for us. So we thank you once again. I'm signing off for now, but we will be back.